Welcome to Off the Wall, a video series about the hat life. Alex from your Goran Brothers virtual styling team here again. Today I'm going to be showing you a pretty basic hat repair you can do at home. I'm teaching you guys how to steam the band in your hat. It's pretty easy. Let's get to it. So we need three tools just to get this job done. The first is your basic steamer. Any kind of steamer will do. It does not have to be fancy. You can use an iron and a jam if you can, but steamers are a little easier. Second, just a towel, just to protect your hands. And third, obviously, the hat you need to steam. Now you can see the issue here of wrinkling. This is something that commonly happens when hats sometimes are shipped or just stacked on top of each other. It's pretty common and quite easy to remove. Okay, so now time to steam the hat. The most important thing to start is how you grip it. If you grip it from the inside like this, you can use your thumb to move the hat along as you steam it. So you can see what I'm doing there with my left thumb, just kind of moving the hat. And then as far as steaming, you just want to go in one direction consistently, just like you're ironing a shirt, and just keep on going, keep the hat moving. You want to keep the hat moving so that way it doesn't get too wet. And if it does, that's what the towel is there for. You can just wipe it off a little bit. You don't want any wetness to really absorb consistently into the band area other than the steam itself. If you need to go back and re-hit a spot, just go back. Just one consistent movement. You can see, this will clean it up nicely for you. Wrinkles, gone. Okay, now let's steam a hat band on a straw hat. Straw, you have to be a little bit more careful of burning your hand than the felts. So what I'm gonna use is that towel to cover my hand on the inside of the hat to protect it from the steam. Now it's similar in that you wanna go in one direction, but it's a little different in that you want to go really quickly and just hit the affected spots rather than all the way around as you do in felt. You can see here, I'm just hitting the quick spots, going quick and moving. That way, not only am I protecting my hand, but I'm also not letting the hat get too moisturized. And again, you can see how I'm using that buffer right there. If you need to hit another spot or go back and crease it over a couple times, that's fine, but don't linger on one spot for too long. It's the best to protect the straw. Give it a good wipe down and you're good to go. So that's it. Hopefully you guys now understand how to do some basic steaming in your hat. If you don't, go to goran.com and open up the chat. Always happy to help answer any questions you have. And keep an eye out because I'm gonna do a future video where I show you guys how to reshape some hats with steam. Until then, keep living that hat life.